No, no, we got to talk about Trump. See, right now, Donald Trump is in the ICU. What is it again? No, he's just resting. He's about, he's going to conduct uh, normal business activities, and, uh, but he has COVID. Donald Trump, the most powerful man in the world. <sighs> and Melania Trump has COVID too. Now, if they can get COVID, this is one of the first thoughts, is there anything stopping COVID from getting us? No, not really. The Chinese have gotten to the President of the United States, and I'm sure some people are scared and panicking. But what if Trump overcomes this, which he probably will, I guess it's what, a 97.8% chance? And in his case, with the medicine and all that stuff, probably closer to 99.3. So it's pretty good odds, I'd say. What if he overcomes this? Is he a hero? Does Trump gain support that he can overcome adversity in the darkest times? And that's what we see right now. COVID, sickness, this virus, this plague of unlike the like unlike anything we've ever seen before in this century, in the last hundred years since the Spanish flu, I believe. I think, and some other people do, and I'm not the only one, that maybe Donald Trump is faking, exaggerating, to gain support, faking to create this situation. He's going to come out of it 100% because he doesn't have it. It's made up. Did he gain support? You know, I was talking about this a while ago about COVID. Now, it's hard to, it's hard to even imagine that it was created in a lab. Mind you, there's so much evidence. I've got various videos on it, in fact. Uh, you can go onto my channel, the Derek Tushot channel, and you can find all kinds of information about how uh, the, uh, the COVID virus was created in a lab in Wuhan. It's a conspiracy, right? Makes sense. You think about it. What if what if the Democrats had something to do with this? I mean, I don't see how it could be. But if they foresee, if they could foresee a potential loss in the upcoming election a year in advance, let's say, or they were worried just in case that there was something they could do, they would be planning it. What would they do? Could they could they somehow manufacture not manufacture a virus, but a plan to work with the Chinese so the COVID comes to America? Panic. Donald Trump doesn't handle it the best. He's often uh, seen as making outrageous quotes like, eh, we'll see what we can do. Ah, it is what it is. Inject some bleach and all those kind of things. So they know the panic will hit and he will lose voters because he's not handling it the way the American public want. Joe Biden comes in, sweeps in on his, his chariot, his, his white horse, his ponies. Joe Biden's riding his ponies. Get Bernie Sanders to talk about Joe Biden arriving on his ponies. See, so here's the thing. I may have lost to a uh, fellow Democrat Joe Biden, but you know, I still pull in for him against Mr. Trump. Trump's an idiot, he's a lunatic. And uh, Biden comes rolling in on his little ponies. He's got my little ponies, we're listening to it on his Sony. Yo, Joe Biden, got the ponies, got the Sony. I don't think this is real. I don't think it is. I mean, he's out there around people, he's not wearing the mask. Yeah, I wear it when I have to. You know, I wear the mask when I have to. Biden's like, you said you were gonna nuke some, to drop a nuclear bomb. He's like, I didn't say that. That's made up. All right, that's about all. Make sure to subscribe to Two Shot Channel. We're, we're, we're like live now. It's like there's no editing. It's sort of like watching the Colbert Report. You don't have the sound effects or anything. It's kind of bland. It's kind of bland like Colbert. Okay, we're just gonna show Jared's feet because he doesn't talk. Hey, move your feet, we'll make voices. Ready, go. Hi. I'm Jared's foot. Oh, look at me dance. Look at me dance, buddy. Do 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 do. Oh, we actually have David Blaine here. He's gonna just comment a little bit on Donald Trump. As you can see, he's an alcoholic. Thanks a lot. That's just like a pocket, just a little pocket change for him. He'll go through that in probably ten minutes. Guess what do you have to say about Trump? Are you scared? He's really scared. Looking at me, scared. He's crying and stuff. Look at the camera's all shake. He's shaking. Look at he's shaking and stuff. He's really scared. Here's Jared. He's an all-star. He's got those this expensive glasses. He goes to all of her people's glasses too. Although I have a slightly better haircut. Showed that to Clayton the other night. He was like, "This movie's fucked." 